know, guys. We're out of luck. Oh, uh, you guys can't even see it. Ball joint went out. Good news, we got a ride back to town later today. And we're going to be off to a lake this morning. We'll meet you guys at the lake. That sun's gonna be in your way. There you guys go. There's the scenery. Just showing up to the lake. We're gonna give her a go and see if we can catch us some tiger trout. Let's do it. guys, this might be the first tiger, I don't know, he was biting it, got a worm on, Buddy Ruff's over there, checking things out, Ooh. I can't decide if that's a fish, I think it is, see here. I don't know where I'm going to set you guys. Let's see if that works. Hopefully. Well guys, the fishing is kind of slow. Um, we can see a lot of these fish. We're trying to figure them out the best that we can. And we got some sort of plan to catch these fish, but um, right now we're gonna take a lunch break. It's about that time I finally did catch one, but I was so far away from the camera. I'm gonna get it on video. I'll have to show you guys it here in a second. I can get closer. But, yeah, fishing's been slow, but, I mean, you can't really beat this view. Snow in the background. I mean, that's just an unbeatable view. But I've been watching these, the water around this, these shorelines, and for some reason the cutthroats are right here, right up against this. But those tigers are out deep. I did hook up with a tiger as well, but he snapped off. I don't even know how big he was. We don't know much about him. My buddy Rob's over here getting ready to build a fire. I'll show you guys this fish real quick. Right there. But alright. Let's go eat some hot dogs. Well guys, we made it back to the truck. Um, we already rode clear back home and got parts and made it back up. The fishing wasn't very good after yesterday. We got the good old Ford here. We're gonna save the day. And I guess we'll get started. Okay guys, we are in business now. Gonna throw some of this stuff in here. Gotta get these poles out. Ooh. Oh, good. I thought I was hooked up. Got the tire back on. Everything's looking okay. Put my poles in the pole holder. Fire it up, and we'll be on our way.
Might stop off at a lake and try it. More likely we're not gonna catch nothing, so. All right. Well, no fish at the other reservoir. Don't know if it even has any or not. Never seen any jump. Just coming off the mountain now. Give you guys a look here. Maybe if it'll even focus for you guys. It's really pretty down there. We'll be down there in a minute. But, I'm gonna get this pickup home and hopefully this won't happen again the next trip. Cause I'm about sick of disasters for one month. We had this truck break down, throwing timing off not very long back and now this ball joint then after I fixed the timing that last time they took my boat out to Kanam and the boat trailer where when the boat came in it bent the boat trailer and broke some welds and I wasn't sure if I was gonna get it home and yeah it's just been an awesome month let me tell you so Hopefully this is the last of the disasters for the year, for or at least for a long time. I hope for the whole year, but I don't know. But all right, we're gonna get headed out here. We're gonna be heading home, and sorry you guys didn't get to see much fish. Sorry you guys didn't get to see much of really too much of anything. I mean, this trip has been nothing but bad luck. Uh, Batteries, we've had really bad issues with batteries. That one night we stayed, we camped the one night, and our batteries kept going from fully charged to 18% within minutes. So I don't know what the deal was with that. But, better wait and make sure she's still coming. But we'll let you know what happens at this next place. and. We'll go from there. Might end up just going straight to the house, but we'll see. Okay, guys. And on off of this thing is quite interesting. Got the savior behind me. Dad's Bronco. My mom's driving it. Dad had to work today and the only way to save me was to get somebody else to drive the other vehicle back. So, sorry it's kind of shaky. So, yesterday we got a ride back to Teasdale with some guys and that was by far the best option for us. We we couldn't have asked for something better there. And then, um, oh. then we had my buddy Rob's wife come pick us up, take us home. And then I got parts this morning and came back up with my mom. We got it all sorted now. Then we're gonna come down here and at least look at this other little reservoir and we just barely stopped at another little bitty one but it didn't look like nothing big was in it and we did a few casts but nothing so you guys did get to see one lake and it was very pretty Hopefully, hopefully we can catch some more this next trip. This trip really was slow, really bad. Never really caught much of anything at all. And we're just, we're just tired and sick of this fishing. How it's not panning out like it usually does. I don't even know if my mom's still here. Yeah, she's right behind me. But thank you guys for watching. 
Click subscribe if you'd like to keep up to date with me. I know there wasn't much to like in this video, but if you want to, click the thumbs up. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys on the next one.